is equal to your knowledge. No, it's not that way. Right? To be able to, to, to say something venerable, you have to have knowledge, objectively, not just subjectively. And based on, on critical thinking, you can analyze what has weight by evidence, and by really science, or what is just an inherited opinion, or uh, hypnotic induction by repetition. Someone said, tradition is great, tradition is great. We have to respect tradition, we have to respect tradition. Then they, come up to be, yeah, I think, that, you know, we have to respect tradition, but this is just parroting what the others said millions of times, <laughs> right? So when you analyze things, really, then you will come to know that, that no, there is no, all opinions are not the same, right? And therefore, of course, you are free to accept any, any opinion you want, but for instance, when Paco said, he told me the Picard is to be practiced like this, like this, with this posture, etc., then I voluntarily believe that. So I'm not saying you should do that, but that's what I did. I'm just telling you my experience. And therefore, to me, if someone comes and says, yeah, but Tomatito does that, but Vicente Mingo does that, but the other do this, I don't care, really. This is the, it's just it couldn't be more irrelevant to me who what other do. <laughs> because I, 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 I voluntarily submit to the Paco's version of this thing. I want to do proving by facts, because I also developing that way and I, I got results from it, so I am sure this works. And I don't, I don't care what other people do, I want to do that only. So this is a personal decision. And therefore, to me, his opinion, Paco Lucia's opinion on this subject, in posture, or any technical matter of his style, is not the same like any other's opinion. Not, not that I am considering less human beings other than one saying it. As human beings, we are equal, because we are all human and should be respected equally as human beings, but, but this doesn't mean that we have the same skill in every field. Like, for instance, I cannot talk about quantum mechanics, like I say, I cannot argue with Einstein, because I am not qualified to do it. So I am, I am ignorant of that field, so how can my opinion in quantum mechanics have to be barely the same, like his opinion, because we are equal as human beings. This is a cool misunderstanding. So, actually, equal means in the level of, of us being human beings, but in every aspect of life, from different arts or, or sciences or different uh, yeah, skills that we have, and in the, all different topics you study in music, in science, or in, in mathematics, in any other thing, the subjects, people have to, of course, it has to be different. To me, it's not the same the opinion of Paco Lucia than any other person regarding Picado. Right? So I'm sorry, but I want I am not equal in this thing. I this, I make the distinction. This this guy is an expert in this field. He proved how he's expert. So I want that. See? I don't care what the others do. Not that I think of the so-called traditional or these spider webs around the traditionals. They are saying is they, I, not that I am considering them not human. I, I also respect them as human beings, but I, I, I decided that what they are saying is irrelevant for me in, in Picado practice, so I don't want to listen to that. <laughs> right, so this is not disrespect to anyone or making others less, not at all. Actually, this is giving the respect comes from, well, you know, Eric Fromm said that this etymologically, the word, the origin of the word is respice, this verse. Uh, this, this phrase respicere 
from the Latin respicere, which means see as it is. That is respect. So you have to respect the other. Respect, what does it mean respect? Anyone who says you have to respect the other is just asking, what does respect mean? You define that. And you see how, how shallow it is. The police parroting the business also, because they don't know what respect is, first of all, define respect. And Eric from said res respicere, respect comes from respicere, which means seen as it is. This is the, the root of the, of, the, of the word respect comes from this Latin word respicere. And the foresee as it is is difficult because then subjectivity enters into the thing. And then, then we are now biased. So there are many problems with this really to, to really know if it is respecting what is the tradition said, you know this empty statement parroting business and they say when well, we have to respect tradition translation please live in the past and be thankful <laughs> you see so some statements are meaningless although presented as respect democracy and we are only well, really behind this empty so you need to know you and what you want of course and then of course I respect people who have opposed opinion. It's not that I, I hate anyone who does not share my opinion in the name of, of free speech, let's say. So free speech means I can insult you, no wait a moment. Free speech doesn't mean you can insult others. <laughs> that is not very that is a conditioning thing. And actually a very detrimental thing. And uh, should be ashamed to be doing that. Because we, we need to respect other human beings also, of course. And if someone has different opinion, great. I learned from, from so much, look, you know, Alan Holdsworth, he was so different. He created a whole vocabulary of chords which has nothing to do with any other guitar player in the whole history of guitar. So he was different, right? His opinion about how to voice, voice chords was just totally, was actually the opposite to any other, <laughs> including by what you anyone, because his, his whole uh, way of thinking was so different that he created that. And it's an art, so this is actually very valuable. Therefore, sometimes in opposite or very contrasting opinions, you find value there for you. So then, therefore, it, it, it's about to have also uh, an open mind and a positive attitude to learn. So my ignorance is not saying that your knowledge because we are equal. We are equal only as human beings, but in knowledge, in every specific aspect and field of knowledge, we have to, to strive to get that knowledge first and then claim respect <laughs> otherwise <laughs> we will be like these people who say, well, tradition has to be respected. We don't know anyway what tradition means. Again, another root of the word traditio, which means it's this traditio Latin thing. I learned this from Maestro Samoji. I will post at the description, some article he wrote about this thing, this is very great, about Paco de Lucia and, and the traditionals. And tradition, tradi traditio, this root of the word, means actually to pass on, or also it means to betray, like traición. Right? Betrayal, traditio. In, in Spanish, this is traición and, be and traición. Betrayal, tradición. Tradicional, tradición. Tradition and traición is the same root. So hello, if you get knowledge, you will see shocking things that are around. So what this tradition means? To me, it means nothing. If it doesn't bring value to my plane, I don't want any of tradition. No, I don't want. If everyone says it, the tradition is great. I don't care. Same like if everyone drinks Coca-Cola, millions of people drink it, then it means it's healthy. So, hello, just think what you are saying. You want to be able to challenge what you think is true. Then you come to a deeper level. Otherwise, you become only a parrot and think you have the rights. And yeah, because democracy, you know, we are all equal. So, let's challenge Einstein in quantum mechanics and Tesla. We will challenge him what is this Tesla thing. I also have my opinion. I will tell him how to do a solar panel. That is because, yeah, my, my opinion is the same value that he is. Or otherwise, I get offended because you are saying Nikola Tesla knows more of electricity conductors than me. So, 
this is an offense actually, I'm very offended because now you are making me less. No, this is a misinterpretation totally disrespectful. Respecting means you treat the other as a human being, not that, that he's same skill in that field. <laughs> so I hope this was useful to you. Thanks and I see you next time.